Good day, everybody. Mike Flores and Manny Patino here with Monarch Homes, another beautiful home brought to you by New Homes 101. I can't wait to get started on this one. This is a 1935 square foot home that's only the heated space, not including the garage. That's a four bedroom, three bathroom. Now, the one thing that strikes me about this home is it's under 2,000 square feet, yet it has an ensuite. And what an ensuite is, is a bathroom that's dedicated to one of the bedrooms other than the master suite. So for longer term guests, for more of a, uh, I guess, kind of an area where it'd be secluded, where they can have their own bathrooms, super nice. I can't wait to show this to you. Um, the elevation on this is a Tuscana Mediterranean, also known as Tuscan. And what you can see here is beautiful pitch. It's a pitched roof all the way from front to back. There's no flat roof on this home. It has lower stone that goes across the entire bottom of this home. Really nice, four coach lights and a beautiful light that comes off the, the 12 foot entrance on the outside. Outside um, landscaping, you've got yourself two-tone stone, you got brickwork, got a tree, got about 10 bushes, a couple of boulders and this beautiful guest path that Monarch Homes is known for. Eight foot garage door with windows. Um, very nice synthetic stucco. And the one thing when you come to visit us folks at Monarch Homes, you're gonna notice the attention to detail. You wanna see, I mean, they, they do everything such with, with care and precision. The grout lines, the lining of all the grout lines throughout the entire home are incredible. Can't wait to show this to you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoy. So as we come in through here, you've got your eight foot door. Um, solid door, super nice. It doesn't ding or dent. It's, it's one of those fiberglass doors with the wood sheathing, or the, I'm sorry, the fiberglass sheathing. And it has the, of course, the peephole. Above it, you got an accent window. And as you're walking by, a couple of the smart features that Monarch Homes is known for is gonna be the video doorbell. Um, you're also gonna have a keyless entry. So when you, you, know, you leave, you can leave your keys you know, pretty much in the home and just use a code. I believe the code actually, or the area does hold three codes. Um, See so if you have everybody wants their own code number. That's a really cool way to do it. That way you can never use a key on the front front key lock. So 12 foot entrance. You got this beautiful foyer. This is one of our warmer pallets, and all the finishes that you're about to see in this home are completely standard. The wood look tile planking, the eight, the, the 10 foot ceilings, the eight foot doors, the backsplash, the cabinetry is absolutely incredible. I can't wait to show this to you. So front bedroom. One of always my favorite guest bedrooms or offices because it does have a nice view, typically a decorative window. All the windows in Monarch Homes bedrooms do open up with the screen. And of course, the eight foot doors um, and the eight foot uh, closet doors are super nice. And in the last video, I kind of showed you a little bit about how this is all designed. You have the long hanging area, you got cubby space and storage. And then on the other side, you have two shorter stack hangings and then you have cubby and storage. So they try to put a lot of rhythm to their design, which I really love about Monarch Homes. Uh, four and a half inch trim, floor trim all the way throughout. Super nice. And the flooring, the carpet, one thing that a lot of people don't um, talk about is the carpeting. I can tell you the carpet on this is made from recycled Coke bottles. It's actually not fabric. So it's impossible to actually stain it. You can stain the pad below it, but it's really good stuff and it lasts a long time. What separates the grades of carpet are gonna be the fibers per square inch and the size of the matting itself or the padding itself underneath. So super nice. Um, right off the foyer, another bedroom and a bathroom. And I think we actually missed a light here. There we go. Bedrooms in this floor plan are about 11 by 11. They're a really good size, so it'll definitely be able to fit any size of bed. It's got your, uh, your cable and your ethernet plugins ready for you in all the bedrooms. All the homes for Monarch come with structured wiring. That's super nice. Self-balancing fans with remote controls. And then here's your first guest bathroom, and what a stunner. This pallet comes with three centimeter thick quartz. And the nichos in there, the shampoo nichos, the height of the tile, very beautiful. If you can actually see how precise these lines are and they cover the grout with the schlutering, which is just a fancy word for metal band. And they do it really well. And of course, cast iron tub, no stamped steel, no plastic tubs. These are tubs that are gonna last a very long time. Got undermount rectangular sinks. You got yourself three CM quartz in the bathrooms. A beautiful mirror that kind of pops out at you. And then these nice bulbs that come down very, very modern looking and a lot of, it provides a lot of light too, a lot of nice lights. 
outside of the foyer, you come into a 10 foot hallway here, which you know separates you from the rest of the home. So as you notice, we could stop people right there if you have someone that you're just you know talking to for a minute, but you don't want them to see your kitchen or your living room. It's a very good floor plan for that. So as we come into here, you're gonna go into your laundry room and all Monarch Homes homes come with um, all cabinetry and all of its hardware. In fact, I believe this is the only upgrade in the entire home. It's just the sink. Everything else that you see in this home is 100% standard. Two by six uh, builds, you got really good plumbing, uh, very good series 80 windows, which are lifetime warrantied. And then this is a part of the smart system. So what this does, this is your structured wiring. Um, the reason it matters is because your low voltage comes into the home one way or another, either through a front bedroom or it'll come into a designated space. We feel that that's the best case. So what we do is put this larger box with a power strip and that allows you to put more than just a modem in there. You can actually put some other things like, you know, amplifiers or if you're serious about your internet, it's really nice to have and it just finishes it off really nice. Look at that quartz, it's really super nice. Quartz, folks, is a man-made product. Um, the nice thing about it is you never have to seal it. Um, it. There's no variations in colors. It stays one color all the way throughout. Some people like that and I, I actually, I'm one of them. I like quartz a lot. So again, another bedroom, but what makes this bedroom very special is if you go right this way, you're gonna see a full bathroom. So this would be for longer term guests. If you have an exercise area and want your own shower and bathroom, I think this is a very good option. It also has an operable window inside here so you can open it up and get some fresh air. And the finishes are identical to the very first bathroom. Same kind of sink, same Delta faucets. By the way, Delta faucets are lifetime warranty. Very nice. Those eight foot doors and 10 foot ceilings really make a huge difference. And right off into here, let's go into the garage. And I mean, look at the, look at the lighting in here. <laughs> so Chamberlain garage door opener, eight foot insulated garage door with windows. 10 foot ceilings, LED lights, um, included shelving. Now, when there's a pitched roof in Monarch Homes, there's gonna be an access point to get into the actual attic space. So as you, you know, upon your entry, when you move that lid, you're gonna have immediately met with a little light switch so that way it illuminates the immediate area. And it's not made for like having like a pool table up there, nothing like that, but I'm sure you could fit a couple of light boxes up there, just, you know, keeping it, keeping it safe. So um, soft water loop, extra plugins, one of my favorite things is gonna be the recirculating pump for the water heater. What that does is that continues um, water circulation throughout all the hot lines. And that way when you turn on your hot water, it actually is seconds to get your hot water versus minutes, which is, I think is brilliant. Um, this is gonna be your drip system that controls all the foliage watering in the front. And it is tieable for the back. And with Monarch Homes, there are literally only four things that are up to the buyers. Your refrigerator, your washer and dryer, and your landscaping. And the, if I got really picky, the epoxy garage flooring. So our homes come with literally everything and more than what you would expect. So as we come out of here, we're gonna go into the living room space. You got your smart thermostat. This is a Nest Google product. And by the way, all the smart features of the home are all Google. So that way you can use the, a similar platform for every part of your home. And look at this. I mean, huge kitchen, GE stainless steel appliances, all the, the hardware. This is a patina gray stain on a maple wood. Uh, you got these beautiful pendant lights. You got a continuing that beautiful quartz throughout. It's got your dishwasher here, trash pull out with recycle. It's really super handy. You don't have your trash can out for everybody to see. And the one thing about this setup too, folks, if you ever do get this kind of a setup, I mean, this is a very elaborated type of setup, but a lot of cooktops out there or push-in ovens will have just a microwave above it, but they don't vent it out. And I think that's the most important part is when you have this type of design, you want this to vent all the way out. So when you're cooking burgers or steaks, it's not kicking it back into the home. So any home Monarch does, whether they have a vent above it or not, is always gonna be ventilated out. Undermount cabinet lighting. I love the backsplash on this palette. Big island, enough for at least four chairs. Really pretty. I mean, look at the size of these. You know, they just, they, they feel quality. 
The attention to detail is stunning too. I mean, you look at all the trim, the paint, I mean, it just looks so uniform. You don't see any bleeding or any, you know, any type of nicks or niches or any little problem with it. I mean, they just did such a great job. Then you have your floating, your, your floating um, tray ceiling with accent lighting all the way around it and this beautiful chandelier. And that matches the front chandelier when you come into the uh, actual home. So it matches really, really well. Nice, beautiful picture windows. All the windows do come with blinds. And this home is 100% LED. And like the tile, people ask us all the time if this is wood. Yeah, oh yeah. So we have uh, two pallets in our roster that call for wood look tile. And it's exactly what it sounds like. It's tile that is designed and colored to re resemble wood. But let me tell you the benefits of it. It never warps. Um, you can get it wet. You can mop it with regular water. A really good tip out there if you're, you know, to mop tile flooring, um, try to not use too many chemicals. Um, try to use maybe vinegar, a very small amount of bleach, and that'll keep your grout lines really nice. And to talk about grout lines, this is an eighth inch grout line. And uh, it, it's just less for it to discolor, I think, which is a really good idea. And the size of the planks are very large. They're not your smaller type planking. They're very, very large planks. Um, back patio door, again, another eight foot door. This one's a six foot wide piece of two glasses. Very standard patio. It's a very large patio, about 15 by six. And this sits on one of the lots here in Metro Verde, Metro Central One, that is backed up to an arroyo. So you don't have any immediate backyard neighbors. You have a little bit of separation between the next development. And I think that's important. A lot of folks like that separation. And uh, the rock walls, Mike, a lot of people coming from Las Vegas or California, they ask us, hey, what's up with these rock walls? Why? <laughs> Why do you guys not use cinder block? Yeah, so we, we don't feel cinder block is a, a very good visual pleaser. Also, we don't like using wood. I think we, we believe that wood does not last very long out here in Las Cruces. We have a lot of variations in weather and they, they say you can have actually all four seasons in one day. And I think that's true. So we do this beautiful rock wall work. They're 12 inches thick. Um, most of them are going to be between five and six foot tall and they look beautiful for years. I mean, they look great. And a couple things too, if you're looking to build a pool, I get asked about pools all the time. So with new home industry or with building codes, all you have to do is be, the hole itself has to be five feet from the actual rock wall. and can be up to two feet to the actual residential area where the foundation starts. So even in a small yard like this, you can have a very nice pool being built and uh, spend more money on actually the heater and some other things and maybe the designs versus just, you know, having to, uh, build this giant hole in the ground. I think that's a, a, you know, one of the information that I'd like to get out there for people to look at because I get asked about pools literally every day. Does Las Cruces not have pools? I'm like, yeah, we got some pools. So you walk in, you got a five tier or a five shelf linen closet. Master suite is gonna be 16 by 14 roughly. Um, big enough to fit, of course, the furniture, TVs, big bedroom, our big bedroom set. Um, and then some more stuff. And then above it, we do this beautiful rope lighting that goes all the way around this tray. And we don't just do the tray beautifully that way with the lighting. We also accent the shelf with a different, a little bit darker tone paint to go all the way around it. And it makes it look beautiful. Self-balancing fan. Um, these are the operable windows that open up with, with screens. And uh, of course, like all the windows in the home at Monarch, they come with blinds, which is great. Um, yes, the door is included. <laughs> so one thing I get asked a lot, does this door come with it or is it an upgrade? No, it comes with it. In fact, everything in this bathroom is standard at Monarch Homes in Metro Central phase one. So you got a beautiful, beautiful soaker tub. You got your um, handheld there. That's all Delta faucets. And man, that's really nice. It has the handheld hand rest, a bigger back rest. We just, that's a really good soaker tub. More beautiful tile work with the schlutering all the way throughout. Glass shower with cobblestone flooring, lots of ledging, um, and just absolutely gorgeous. The his and hers sinks, undermount rectangular sinks, uh, delta faucets, the dimensional mirrors, and then the drop down lighting just set this place off really nice. And of course, uh, cabinet hardware at Monarch is always included. And who doesn't like a big, nice closet with functionality and finish in mind? You know, you always want every part of the home to be finished, just like the garage, right? You want it to be insulated and painted and trimmed. Um, you want it to look good. It's a part of the home. So we believe that closets are the same way. Don't just leave a, a shelf, but we actually finish it off on the ends of it. We put a little bit more into the closets to give you that nice presentation. We want you to be very proud of the home.
In the mass, I mean, in the great room, you'll notice a flat screen pre-wire. That is also standard for all Monarch homes. Um, if you get, of course, a fireplace in one of the homes, the flat screen pre-wire comes with that as well, but this is always a good thing to see. Well, folks, that'll wrap it up for the 18, oh, this is the 1935 Toscana. I look forward to seeing you soon. Give us a call if you have any questions. Thank you.